सो हाई डियर एरीज अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जर्नल लव रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द एरीज सन मून विनस राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जर्नल इट माइट और माइट नॉट रेजोनेट विद योर द फर्स्ट प्लेस द सेकेंड थिंग द रोल्स कैन बी रिवर्स ऑल्सो थर्ड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फ्रॉम ए टिल द फोर्टीन ऑफ ऑगस्ट एंड दिस रीडिंग इज वैलिड फॉर एवरी ट्वेल्व साइन दैट यू आर डीलिंग विद अलॉन्ग विद योर ओन साइन सो लेट स्टार्ट ओके दिस रीडिंग इज नॉट वैलिड फॉर दोज हु आर वेटिंग फॉर समबडी फ्रॉम पास सेवन एट टेन ईयर्स और समथिंग लाइक दैट नो maximum 2 years yep let's see your person or your partner's current feelings for you right now at this present moment let's see what's happening it is we have the 9 of cups and the bottom of the deck is a star card here 9 of cups is the card of wish fulfillment this person might be taking this situation like or you uh, as a person like a kind of a wish fulfillment for them or they feel or they are realizing that you are the one person who really makes them happy in every context let's clarify the 9 of cups here let's uh, clarify the 9 of cups we have the lovers the magician and the knight of cups okay see what happening uh, in this situation is aries this person is having another option too in their life it could be possible they left you for someone else or you might be having someone else in your life but whatever the case may be this person is trying to manifest uh, like a proposal from your side or they feel like they should go towards you with a solid proposal with uh, with a love and uh, for some of your marriage proposal there is something here in this situation that stopping this person from taking any kind of action but they are realizing that you are make you make them really really happy you go you are one of those people who they consider as a soulmate kind of energy as well and they are very much attracted to you physically as well so they are manifesting some kind of uh, opportunity to have a connection with you on a romantic level so uh, the thing here is the blockage here is that either you or this person might be having somebody else in the equation that is a problem here but they definitely see you as their wish fulfillment they definitely see you uh, and them having a soul connection a soul tie and uh, they are manifesting something beautiful in the situation something like a solid and uh, romantic kind of situation in the connection let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation aries from your side we have the page of swords okay i think you are uh, keeping this person at a distance you are watching them from a distance now it could be possible that this is a, a like a newish kind of energy a newish mean to say that you are talking to them like uh, uh, might be few from few weeks only but you are uh, in this energy of uh, uh, feeling like a little bit attracted towards them so you are keeping this person at a distance you are watching them from a distance or stalking them might be let's clarify the page of swords this on and off communication happening in the situation here okay and you might be thinking like this person is not that much serious about you or that thing six of wands in reverse and the five of swords and the ace of wands right see uh it could be possible that uh, both of you were connected to each other on a friendship level only and somebody else came in the equation and this person chose somebody else over you now you think you feel like this person and you don't have any chance and you're you're like a pride you can say your ego is telling you to uh, have anything uh, anything like a uh, romantic with this person anything like of that sort with this person you are watching this person's every move okay but your mind your logical mind your ego you can say your ego self is trying to protect you from going towards this person because deep inside you feel like no it is not going to work out with this person even if you are going to try even if they are going to come forward towards you so you have certain kind of uh, uh, we can say blockage in the situation where uh, you are like uh, just trying to protect yourself from being hurt in the situation right so you are just trying to be in this energy of let me just watch from a distance let me keep this person at a distance but let me resist this energy of having something romantic or having something more than friendship kind of energy with them yes yeah, see you are just trying to protect yourself from being hurt again i'm telling you again because might be the same person hurted you in the past or somebody else hurted you in the past this was the same situation that you are encountering again it's a cycle that you feel like you should not uh, repeat let's see what this person wants from you what are their intentions for the situation aries
temperance their intention is to be very very patient with the situation and wait for the time when you guys are going to be together they would don't want to lose temper they don't want to run behind you they don't want to chase the situation they uh, just very patiently like a mature person like an adult person they just want to wait and then do the things let's clarify the temperance here We have the world card, the page of swords and the chariot. Wow. Mm -hmm. See, there is something that they need to put an end to before they can come forward and make this success, make this connection between you and them successful or victorious. Now, some of uh, some of you, the long distance in this relationship is a like major problem, major issue. They might have to travel towards you or they might have to shift to the like city or the country or whatever you call it. The place wherever you are because of the long distance. For some of you it could be possible that they have to end some kind of marriage or commitment or uh, a situation where they are having kids with somebody else. So they want to patiently wait for the time when they will be able to put an end to something that they need to end before they can come forward and make this connection work out with you. They have to make a lot of changes in their life. They have to make a lot of sacrifices, you can say. And they want to patiently wait for the time when everything in their individual life is going to be sorted so that they can come towards you with any kind of issue and they can create a beautiful world with you. So they definitely want to be with you and they want to put an end to something here. Now for some of you, it could be long distance relationship. They want to put an end to the distance. For some of you, it could be possible that they have kid with someone else. So they want to put an end to that relationship, but they want to take care of the kid. And then they want to come towards you when everything is going to be uh, like clear and the path is going to be clear. Then only they want to come forward and create something very beautiful with you. This is what this person's intentions are regarding the situation. This is really good. Let's see. Uh, what do you want from this particular person or situation, Aries? What are your intentions for this situation? We have the Three of Swords. Okay. You don't want to have any kind of false hopes from this situation. Okay. You don't want to get hurt again. I think you are still feeling the pain from uh, a previous connection or because of your experiences in love and relationship, you are not opening up to any person, any situation right now. You just want to keep yourself from this hurt and pain. Keep yourself away from this hurt and pain. Uh, let's clarify the three of swords. We have the two of pentacles, the king of pentacles, the queen of swords. Okay. See, you don't want to be in any kind of confusion or you don't want to be an option in anyone's life. So you just want to focus on your individual name, fame, success, your individual growth in every area of your life. And at the same time, you just want to de remain detached from the outcome of the situation. Although we all are humans and we uh, often tend to think like, okay, uh, what, uh, what is going to happen? Uh, like uh, the outcome is going to be like this or that or this. You don't want to think about the outcome like that. You just want to remain detached from the situation and you don't want to be an option to anyone on earth. So you are like, okay, even if it is painful for me, to get out of the situation completely but i'm going to choose myself and my own life and i'm going to remain detached from the situation because it it's going to hurt a lot so you don't want any kind of trap you don't want any kind of mental jail or heartbreak again in your life because you have experienced this kind of uh, situation before in your life so you are not uh, interested in repeating the same cycle again in the situation in your love life you can say so you just want to remain detached and focus on your individual growth and success. Okay, not on the same page, I think. Let's see what's coming towards you till the 14th of August. Aries, let's see. We have Ace of Pentacles in reverse here. So I don't see the brand new beginning is happening here. The, the person that wants to like... Uh, manifest a brand new beginning with you i think they are not uh, taking the action we want a lot of thing in our life right like uh, i might be wanting uh, like uh, prince charming or something that's already with someone else or 
they might be having some other uh, responsibilities or something like that but they might not be wanting us on the same uh, frequency so yeah this person might be wanting you but they don't have the courage to take the action or simply they are not able to take the action for whatever reason so i don't see that happening at all right now let's clarify the ace of pentacles in reverse here you have the eight of wands the queen of pentacles the justice okay so i think you guys are going to have a proper long conversation like face to face conversation in some cases or uh, whatever whatever the mode of communication is it doesn't matter but you guys are going to have a proper communication regarding the situation and both of you are going to take the right decision right now uh, according to the situation and i think the right decision right now is to focus on your individual lives and uh, let's see where things can go in the future but one of you is resisting uh taking any kind of initiative in the situation because the situation or which because the timing might not be right or one of you is not able to see the future with the other person here whatever the case may be i do see lots of communication happening regarding the future of this connection and both of you are going to take a particular decision especially you aries you are going to take the right decision in the situation and the right decision is to focus on your individual energy and growth and uh, don't be an uh, and not to be an option in the situation and this is what you are going to do and this is what's coming your way the decision that you are going to make is going to make you feel very very proud in the future as well this is the right thing that you are doing very very fantastic let's see the guidance for you guys in the situation aries we have the fool the six of pentacles and the king of pentacles right see you have the risk that you want to take uh, like the the risk like of going solo that you want to take in your life is going to prove a lot of lot of uh, uh, like is going to prove the best decision of your life because i do see lots of stability coming in lots of money abundance and prosperity coming in and along with that lots of maturity and grounded kind of energies are also coming in and as you are going to go uh, on your like a uh, solo journey i do see a mature and beautiful energy grounded kind of energy entering in your life on the way okay so you are on the right track just keep going ahead if you by any chance you are not doing this you should do this because i do see the prosperity the abundance the happiness the connection the love that you are waiting for is going to be with someone else with some other energy because this energy this situation is quite messy and uh, i'm not saying that this person is the, in, not in love with you or they are not going to provide you a like solid base or something no but i feel like the moment you will realize your self worth and the moment you are going to accept the situation the way it is you will start moving on in your uh, own life's direction in your own growth and expansion kind of direction yourself i don't have to even say it to you and you are going to find the right person along the journey so yep this is what i have for you for this week Thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.